right, I got a good one for you today. It's gonna be all upper body, so please grab those weights if you have any. If you don't, just grab anything around the house. Just make sure it's equal weight, because these workouts are meant for you to do anywhere. Or if you don't have anything, just use, make a fist. <laughs> all right, you guys, have your legs a little bit hips apart. Toes facing forward, stomach in nice and tight, engaging those abs, bringing the hips just a little bit forward because we just want to protect that spine, hip, and core area. Okay, you guys, this is what I want you to do is I want you to turn out your arms, having your palms facing forward. All right, watch me first. I'm going to show you our first move. What we're going to do is we're going to go up like a rainbow almost down into a shoulder press, bring that up, palms are facing forward the whole time, and then right back down here. So throughout the whole thing, I want your palms to face forward, so make sure they're facing me. All right, you guys ready? Here we go, bring them up, nice and slow, overhead, bring that down just right here, shoulder level, right back up, and then open. Straight arms all the way up, stomach's in tight, Make sure not to arch that back. You gotta have that stomach in nice and tight so your back's not arching, especially when you're bringing that up overhead and down. And actually, when you lift your arms up and when you lift them down, you're actually working those abs because it naturally engages them. and out. All right, you guys, we have two more. Overhead, bring it down, bring it up, open. Last time, here we go. Overhead, down, up, open. Awesome. Okay, so now the next one we are going to do is palms are gonna be up again. Watch me first, we're gonna do a half curl Elbows are going to go back and then a kick back, forward, elbows back in, and then down. So let me show you from this side. Okay, you guys ready? It's going to go up just by a shelf. Bring those elbows back, kick back, right here, elbow back in, down. Make sense? All right, here we go. Up, halfway, elbows back, kick it back, right here. Elbows in, all the way down. Up, elbows, kick it back. Bring the elbows back forward, all the way down. Up, shelf, I call that a shelf. Kick it back, here, elbows in, down. Curl up to that shelf. Bring those elbows back, kick it back. Here, elbows, down. Up halfway, shelf, elbows back, Kick it back. Ooh, I'm feeling those triceps. I don't know about you. I am. Bringing it up. Elbows back. Kick it back. Right here. Elbows forward. All the way down. Two more, guys. Shelf. Now, I have an itch on my nose. <laughs> Bring it up. Out. Back in. And then that. Okay, I have to seriously itch this. <laughs> Okay, that was really All right, you guys, doing hammer hold. A hammer hold is when you hold it like this. All right, so your palms are in. I want you to hold it right like this. And what are you gonna do is you're gonna go out just a little bit and then up and then down and then down. Really engage uh, those abs on this one because although you should already have them engaged, just a reminder to get them back in there because this really works your abs as well as your shoulders. All right, you guys, ready? So you're gonna go up right here, up to like a T, down, and then down. There you go. So it's one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Making sure you don't go beyond that shoulder. So I don't want you to go higher than your shoulder, just right here, making a T with your arms, nice, up, down, up, down, one more, nice, all right you guys, put your waist down real quick, get yourself a drink, then we're gonna come back, and I don't know where my drink is, it's behind you, so 
I'm not gonna go grab it. But get yourself a quick drink. Make sure not to gulp it. You just wanna take like a little sips, really just to water that mouth. Give yourself a little hydration. All right, dish your water or whatever you're drinking. Hopefully it's water, lemon water, fruit water. All right, you guys, hold yourself in a hammer hold. Now, what, I, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go across our body and then right back down. We're gonna go across our body and then right back down. So up, up you're, so I'm tap, I'm actually, I don't know if you can see, but I'm actually tapping my shoulder and then I go down. Tap my shoulder and then down. Now I'm not resting my hand on there, it's very light. Crossing over and then down. Cross over and then down. I think my daughter was gonna hand me my water. I have another water break coming up here, you're on. <laughs> and then down. Cross it over, down. All right, we got four more. Four, three, two, last one. One, nice. All right, now I want your palms to face back. What we're gonna do is just gonna go back and then right here. So make sure you stop right by these legs here and you're just gonna go back and then here. So here's the back view. I don't touch them together, they're just right here. Just like they're about to touch and then right back. Behind you, forward. Behind you, forward. Nice. All right, you guys, we have two more. So on this last one, I want you to hold it behind you. Hold, hold it, hold it. I'm gonna show you a side view here, what we're gonna do. You're gonna go up over that butt and then right back down. Here's from the back view, lift it up and then down. Do not touch that butt. Do not touch your back. Don't let those weights or your hands touch that body back there. All right, you have four more. Four. Three, I'm gonna to go to the side so you can see what we're gonna do here. Two, actually no, I'm gonna go back. One, now pulse it in and out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo, bring that out. Oh, I don't know about you, but I felt that one. Oh, I really felt that one. Okay, you guys, so we're gonna do those crossovers again. So you're gonna cross over, but then you're gonna lift back right like that. So you're gonna cross over, and then watch me from the side, my elbow goes up, okay? So I cross over, and then back. Cross over, lift it back. So that elbow goes behind you, not out to the side, but directly behind you when you go down. Lift it up, nice. Watch those shoulders on this one. You don't wanna be like this. Relax your shoulders, relax your shoulders. Make them nice and soft. Oops, I almost screwed up there. <laughs> I almost took my elbow out, right behind you. Tap it, right behind you. One more. Nice job, guys. All right, let's put down the weights. Last water break. So get yourself some quick water and a quick drink and my daughter's coming for mine. Thank you. I have lemon water today, but I was really thirsty. Thank you. All right, you guys, grab those weights again. Come meet me again. Toes are forward, a little bit far apart. Abs are tucked in nice and tight. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. You're gonna be in a hammer hold right here, okay? You're gonna curl up, meet them in the middle. Okay, and then you're gonna punch out one, punch out two, and then we're gonna go right back here. A little bit closer so you can see. So we're going up, now they're almost touching but not. Punch it forward, punch it forward, and then bringing it right back here. Here we go. Curl it up in the middle. One, two, bring it down. Up, one, two, bringing it down. Holding it away from that chest. Ladies, don't be using your boobs for a uh, shelf there, okay? Oh, I should not use that word. Don't use your chest as a shelf. And down. Up. Up. Nice 
Nice job, guys. Stomach's tight. Straighten those arms. We have two more. One, two, one more. One, two. Nice. All right, shake that out. Good job, guys. Okay, now I want you to hold your weights like this. So right here in front of you, and you see I'm a little bit open there. That's how you want it to be. Um, make sure with this one, relax your shoulders. So everybody go up with your shoulders and drop them real fast. Now I just want you to naturally lift those weights up. Don't go like that. Relax those um, shoulders for me. And what you're going to do is just going to go out like this. So my palms are facing back and now they're facing me. So here's what it looks like up close. So you're here, you go out and then right back here. So the top part of my arms do not move. Just bending at that elbow, out. It's almost like you're dumping water. Pour it out, Psh. bring it back in. Nice job, guys. All right, we have three more. Three, two, one more. One, nice job. All right, drop those weights. It's time to cool down, that was it. Nice and easy, right? Not too bad. All right, open up nice and wide with your legs a little bit wider. What we're gonna have you do is stretch over to the side. We're not doing a deep stretch today. I'm actually wanting you to push up. So this isn't really hanging or doing nothing. It's really this arm. I want you to pretend like you're hanging from somewhere. Just really elongating. And then bring that down. Other side, we're just gonna go over just a little bit here again. Remember this side's not really doing too much, but it's really up here. So I want you to reach for that ceiling. Pretend you're hanging from somewhere. And down, nice. All right, a cross over. So what you do is you cross over. So straighten one arm, cross it over by the elbow. Give me a high five. Slowly bring it down to the wrist area and pull it towards you. Very little pull, nothing crazy. And drop that. Now do the other one, straighten the arm first. The other arm goes up and over. Give me a high five by that elbow. And hold. Slowly bring it down by the wrist area and bring it into you. And slowly drop it. I want you to grab your hands behind you and pull down. However you want to grab those arms, just pull down, don't pull out. If you can, tilt your head back. If not, just keep looking forward with me. I cannot do that because I have neck issues. All right, go forward now, arching that upper back so this is what it looks like from the side view. Drop that head between those arms. And I want you to pretend I'm in front of you pulling those hands gently towards me. And release, nice. All right, we're gonna go one arm up and across and over. And we're gonna alternate. So swinging it across the arm and open. One more on this side. All right, give me the, I call these swimmer arms because the swimmers always do it. Just flapping open and close. Always reminds me of swimmers when you see them about to do their race. Crisscrossing over, swinging them open. One more, nice. All right, put your arm in front like this, cross over there and pull it towards you just gently, very gently, nothing crazy. Other side, flip it over this one, over those knuckles and pull it towards you gently. Nice, other arm, um, palm facing me, <laughs> I couldn't think of the word. All right, and pull it towards you nice and gently. Great. Flip that over, over the knuckles, push it in towards you. 
Nice. And release. All right, you guys, as always, I want to leave you with the breathing in technique that I always do to kind of cool down. All right, so what we do is we inhale through the nose, nice and deep, filling in those lungs. So nice, slow, deep breath. Overhead, you're going to hold it. And then we're going to come down forward, exhaling out of our mouth, nice and slow. All right, we're going to do that three times. So here we go. Inhale up. Nice and slow, nice and slow, and hold, and exhale out of the mouth. Nice. Again, up, hold, and exhale out. One more time, up, hold, exhale out. Awesome job, guys. Good job. Good job uh, showing up. Hopefully you did it with me. If not, come and do it again. Leave me a comment. Let me know how you like it, how you're feeling. And if there's anything else you'd like me to do exercise-wise, um, I'm always open for suggestions. And as always, here's to a healthier you. Bye, guys.